This is Rajiv Khanna's favorite sound. He's a collector of motorcycles. To get a Harley Davidson in India, he had to import it himself. How many Harley Davidsons are there in India at the moment? I would figure there won't be more than about 50. There's no shortage of motorcycles in India. It's the world's second largest market, but most aren't so fancy. Harley's one of the brands revving up to change that. Anup Prakash is in charge of opening Harley's first five dealerships in India. I think there's a uh, huge appreciation for just the strength of the brand and what it means to uh, use it as a, a form of self-expression. The brand's been slammed by America's Great Recession. Its stock price two years ago was $51. Today, it's around $21. Are there enough riders like Rajiv, who's a well-to-do restaurateur, right. you okay? let's go, yeah. to help boost Harley's well, revenues? It's good that Harley Davidson's come in now because then they can uh, tap uh, this growing niche market, you know, uh, going forward. It's going to take some time. We need better roads. Just getting into India has been a rough road. In 2007, U.S. trade negotiators made a swap. Harley could sell motorcycles in India. In exchange, India could sell mangoes in America. Harley's got another roadblock. India's taxes and tariff result in around a 100% increase from the U.S. price. India's riders will fork over between fourteen dollars and $60,000. Now that Harley's gotten in, next step. All right, born to be wild, right? Creating a culture. 